Remember, we'd love to hear from you, so just send us your comments about the show on Facebook and Twitter. But first, over the last three weeks, we've brought you the remarkable transformation of former All Black Inga Twingamala. Inga's journey is not over, but he reached one of his critical milestones on Thursday night in the triple thriller fight. Here's John Utanga with his journey to date. Inga, the swinger, Twingamala. The weigh-in, 24 hours before the triple thriller fight night. OK, Inga Twingamala is 139.3. You looked a bit disappointed there for a second. Oh, I, hey, it, it is what it is. It's been hard, but look, I, I'm further up the ladder than I was you know, a few months ago. So I, I'm, I'm OK. I'm happy. Inga's opponent is former police sergeant Tony Solomona. Although it's meant to be an exhibition match, when you get two Samoans in the ring, there's no such thing as exhibition. We just, it's, uh, it's not personal, it's all business, and we'll be friends after it. So. But just getting here in shape to fight is what it's all about. It's been a tough few years for the likeable former All Black. Business failures, family problems, his ballooning weight. He had to turn his life around. And the triple thriller fight night is part of his journey back. And for the past seven months, he's been working hard to get fighting fit. At first line, I think we both you. I dreaded walking in here 10 days ago with Ali. Uh, Jump on the scales, let's see where you're at, and let's talk about what needs to be done. With the increased fitness and weight loss, a new commitment. Good morning. Inga's has also decided to run the Auckland Marathon in November, and to do it as a Heart Foundation runner. Call A. And my trainer said to me, give yourself some goals. I probably picked the two hardest goals that I, I, I could think of, but at the same time, it's given me something to aim for. Inga's taking on a huge burden on this journey, and it's not just physical. Being a fight promoter is hugely stressful. And on the eve of the big night, his main event fighter has had to withdraw due to injury. Very, very disappointed, and it's been left to the last minute, you know, and uh, promoters don't like this kind of uh, thing, but, you know, you expect the unexpected in the world of boxing. We just got to pull together. There's a lot of other fighters that, you know, this means something to them as well. So we just have to get on with it, really. It's a big blow for Inga, but the show must go on. The first to Ingamala up is son Jordan. It's a proud dad who looks on. Just happy for him. He's trained hard in the last few months. Finally, he has the opportunity to showcase his talent again. So, yeah, nervous, but good. No real power in that. That's just sort of putting it out there. Bit of a feeler type. Oh. And it's a punch. I was just going to say, it's only going to be a matter of time before he lands a heavy shot. That was a feeler. But he's got those gloves up, which is making it hard to get there that big finish punch. Nice. Left to the right the combination. Here. Referee's going to stop the fight. And the Those referee steps in. Jordan Later in the evening, heavyweight Baba Tuingamala slugs his way to a split decision win. Seaboy, the wild swings. Fighting out of the red corner. Backstage in a crowded warm-up room, Inga tries to focus on the fight. It's a shot. You know, for him, it's a corporate fight, so, you know, um, even though it's a corporate fight, it is very challenging, and he's fighting a tough guy, so I guess I said, you know, God bless and have a good well. <laughs> then it's all on. So Inga the swinger, 50 seconds to go. Can he unleash the beast? Tony Solomon is going to be standing there saying, I don't want to be tagged in your own fight. Winner by unanimous decision out of the red corner. He did OK, considering he hasn't really had a lot of rest, you know. It's just been going non-stop this week. So I'm, I'm proud that he, it came out all right. We got the right results. <laughs> I get the feeling you're happy that's over. Yeah, <laughs> really happy that's over. But uh, look, I want to congratulate Tony, Sergeant Solomon, for stepping in. It takes a lot of guts as you get into the ring. A lot of admiration for you also. First, I'd like to thank my beautiful wife, Daphne. Um, and, uh, and all my children. It's a win on the nights for Inga, but the big guy knows this is just a footnote on his journey to better health.
five months ago, I was looking down the barrel. You know, my, my friend Fats passed away and I didn't want to be another statistic. So it is worth it. it it's hard work, you know. Um, it's not easy. A lot of time, energy and money has gone into it. But just to see, you know, even my sons, you know, enjoy the moment. And this is what it's about them as well.